Hello everyone and welcome to another update on the market. For today I decided to cover Euro versus US dollar. I will speak about the gold market, crude oil, Bitcoin versus US dollar and dollar index. I will start with the Euro versus US dollar first. Uh, so what we can see here is this is the daily time frame. And we can see that market is working in the uh, horizontal more like a rectangle um, consolidation with we have basically a strong resistance around 1.1 1 .1, 100 area we <clears throat> we can see here that market traded and reacted of this zone um, multiple times so you can see here here market also rejected around this area here and most recently market tried to break this resistance and then failed <clears throat> so um, this is a long uh, time frame picture. If we go lower frames, we can see that on the hourly time frame, we also broke some, like, some most recent uh, like rising trend lines. Uh, market had a consolidation here and then extended lower. So um, the likely scenario, most likely scenario, is the market to extend further downside, maybe retest the low at 1.0940, and even try to retest this rising trend line around 1.0. 895 and the alternative scenario will be if the market can really you know start aggressively to go let's say higher and retake 1.1 142 and if market can hold above this zone then this can open the door for higher prices and uh, for the potential test of the next resistance or pivot point around 1.1 150 mark which is this level here the next uh, symbol that we will uh, that we'll cover is uh, is a gold market. So we can see here that there is a strong tail from the background, and the market is trading around in, into this uh, tail that we had this where we had this big big rejection in the background. Uh, what we had also is a rejection in a few days ago. We also had rejection of that pin bar area. On the hourly time frame, we can see that. It kind of broke the rising trend line so this was the most recent uh, rising trend line and market is now testing this area so if we don't see aggressive buying and new high let's say um, and hold above then there is a chance this can be a successful test uh, basically no demand and then potential for the secondary down lag and uh, the downside objectives are set um, around to, um, 2017 and uh, 2027 mark so the alternative scenario will be if the market can trade higher, retake uh, 2090, uh, hold above, and then this will be a good sign for the market to retest even 2123 or even fully 2140 mark. Speaking of the crude oil, <clears throat> what we can see here is that market broke this rising trend line market is now retesting the previous swing lows so i see potential for the market to, to try to go lower and uh, retest 71.11 eventually even 70.47 and even this uh, low at 67.88 so this is most likely scenario even though we you may, we might see here that market trying to break this supply trend line but this is overall a weak rally into the resistance so potential for the downside lag i think it's a most likely scenario that we'll see this downside move anything meaningful to the upside really i would like to see only the mark if market can clear all of this area <clears throat> trade higher hold above and that will be a sign for retest of 76 mark or even higher prices but the downside scenario is most likely at this point now speaking of the bitcoin so market um, is breaking here we can see that um, market started to break out yesterday so we got this breakout and this is a follow-through day so this was a tight consolidation triangle we spoke about and we can see this morning basically market started to extend higher now for this to hold and um, to be a successful breakout on that only uh, the time will show us if the market if this will be a successful breakout or not overall I would like to see the market on the pullbacks that we have a lighter pullbacks <clears throat> that market is building higher versus some bigger 
rejections and then hold below which will be a sign for the fake breakout and potential retest of 41,700 mark. In case of the successful breakout, um, I would like this to, uh, so I would like the supply to be on the test, uh, to be the shallow, shallow supply and then we can see potential rally if that's the case. Um, and the next objective we can also project here um, like the projection based on this just pattern is around around 50,000 so 50,000 uh, for the Bitcoin but we will see time will time will show and for now mark you just had this markup phase we'll see if the reaction of sellers will be strong and if they can back all the way down below 44,000 and so then there is a chance for this like to be like a fake breakout uh, <clears throat> and to check the dollar index what we have on the dollar index is that yeah, let's go also to the daily frame we got this uh, reaction here the momentum we lost momentum but from the other side we have here uh, some area in around the 180 mark so market can try to visit that so far it's trading and building some higher lows but we will see if market can hold this rising trend line and keep trading higher towards uh, 1185 or 102.45 or we can have a sell-off break of 101 level and then trying to trade lower towards the 100.66 that will be all for this update, guys. I hope that you did enjoy. Have a good trading day and speak to you from tomorrow morning.